One may be lucky to have good teachers. When I studied bachiller, I had an excellent chemistry teacher, and it was he who introduced me to the chemistry vocation. And then I came to Murcia, and the only faculty dealing with experimental sciences was the faculty of chemistry, and to be honest, I did it because I liked it, and once here, I addressed to organic chemistry. The group I lead was created as a result of my stay in 1976 in England, and the group was created when I came back here, uh, and then I was working in synthetic meteorology. Then, when this was created, we worked on alkaloid synthesis of sea origin with biological activity, and for the last 15 years, we have been working on a very multidisciplinary chemistry in which we work on current questions linked to organic materials. We're working on the design of molecules that realize functions. And one of the functions is that they're able uh, to perform is detecting toxic metals in watery means. And we're right now designing several molecular materials that have been very successful uh, when detecting uh, plam and, and mercury in very low concentrations. One of them has already been patented and the other is being patented now. The transference of our group is basically made by means of publications. We also have some patents, as I mentioned above. We have had quite a close link to pharmaceutical companies, mainly. Nowadays, normally, People, the, the doctors who are in a laboratory, they work in a laboratory for the whole working day and, and even longer. And then uh, they come every day or maybe every four or five days and we talk and discuss how experiments are going. We come in on the working of the molecules that they have prepared and we design new experiments or guide this strategy in order to prepare new compounds that we that can have more remarkable properties than the ones that have been prepared, and we comment on them. I prefer this cousin in the lab than in the office. Working every day is essential to make it work properly. The citizen has no notice of what is being done here. We're working with the state money, and we have to justify that state money by spending it properly and doing good research. That creates scientific advance that allows our future chemists end up with a solid education. In that way, afterwards, they can take important decisions in their working positions, and it may happen that what they're doing here has a specific use one day. Researchers need tranquility when preparing their programs and when planning their research. The fact of having a long-term financing gives you tranquility. And the most important is that yearly contributions are not fragmented. But the organization allows the transference from a concept to the other. This year is the second one we have been granted with this program. And it has allowed me some equipment that was highly important for me and which I had not foreseen previously. So I think that the fact that a longer program than usual has been designed and with some kind of flexibility and fragmentation, this for us is fundamental. I work for the state. I'm paid for researching and this is why I have to research, because it's my profession. A different thing is when profession needs a person and this personality I vote to you having holidays, break days to have some rest, because you're always thinking of the same. Even you're in Metheron enjoying summer holidays, you're thinking of the same thing, and it's very difficult. I mean, I've been involved in this since 1970, and I cannot do another thing.